Hey everybody. So my biggest problem is getting to a destination and there's no 1450 outlet for level two charging anywhere. And all I have is a 110 volt outlet and that's everywhere. So I had my electrician make me this 1450 NEMA box, which is basically a NEMA box with two 110 cable coming out of it and it will give us 220 volts when we uh, plug it in. Now it's very important that you plug in both ends to two different circuits so uh, we'll get the 20 amp uh, charging. So I had my electrician make me this box and it's not UL approved or anything but it works and uh, any person with basic electrical knowledge can build this box for you. So let's show you how it works. So I'm using a 20 gauge heavy duty extension cord for this 20 amp charging box. Now it's very important that you don't exceed 20 amps when charging, otherwise the breaker will get really hot and it'll trip. So Tommy's gonna go ahead and plug in the cord there. And he's gonna do this side. And as you can see, we're getting 220 volts of power to this box with the red light indicator is on. And it's telling me I got 220. So I'm gonna plug in the Tesla mobile charger. And we got the light on and it's ready to go. So, I'm going to show you that it works. So Tommy is going to come right here and he's going to push this button. Go ahead and push that button, son. Don't plug it in yet because I'm going to go into the car. And I'm going to change the charging app to 20 amps. All right, set that 20. Now go ahead, Tommy, go ahead and uh, plug it in. It's charging at 20 amps. Let's give it a second. So there you go. Charging at 20 amps gives you 17 miles an hour from two 110 outlet. And those 110 household outlets can be found anywhere. Take care, everybody.